Hello. Over the next four minutes we're going to take a quick look at the Nolan's Intercompany Postings module. With minimal setup this module will allow you to quickly and easily post transactions between multiple Dynamics GP companies, hopefully saving you many hours of manual posting and reconciling companies every month. So what are some of the benefits? Well you can set this module up to automatically post to one or many Dynamics GP companies from just one intercompany posting and these postings can originate from any ledger and fully support multi-currency between companies. You can transfer cash from one company checkbook ID to another company checkbook ID and you can view and drill back into the original posting from one Dynamics company without having to log back into the original company. Also, intercompany postings comes with an audit window so you can check the status of any intercompany transactions. So let's take a look. What I'm going to do is enter an intercompany payables transaction. I'm going to put the amount in here and I've already got an intercompany batch I'm going to add this transaction to. I'm going to give it an invoice number and I have a choice. I can predefine the intercompany nominal codes that this journal will post to or I can add the destination intercompany code on the fly when I put the transaction on. I just save this transaction and I'm going to post it. What it's going to do now is going to create journals in this company and they're going to post directly through to the general ledger and it's also going to create a journal in the destination company and it's given me that journal number here. If I wanted to I could actually stop it posting through to the general ledger which would allow me to go in and check the journal before it's posted. Next, I'm going to enter an intercompany bank transfer. What I'm going to do is select the checkbook ID that I want from this company and I'm just going to put in my intercompany nominal code. And once I've entered that, you can see over on the right hand side, it's actually picked up the destination company. So it will now let me select the checkbook from the destination company. I'm going to give it an amount and I might add some extra narrative here which will post through into the destination company on the on the journal. When I post that you'll see the same thing happens, I'll get a journal created and also it will tell me the journal number that's been posted through into the destination company. Once that's posted both sides of that transaction will be available on the bank reconciliations. If I want to check those postings in the destination company, I can log in as you can see now I'm in Fabricam Inc. and I've got a smart list saved here that shows me all the journals created today. I'm going to click on this one and you can see that was that payables transaction that I originally posted and I was quickly able to drill into it and see the original transaction despite being logged into the destination company. I didn't have to log out and go back into the other company. Finally, I might want to check the status of my intercompany transactions. So I'm just going to open up my audit window here and select the company that I want to look at. And you can see here there's a colour coding system that tells me the status of the transactions. So here, for instance, I've got this, this journal created. And I'm able to drill in and see what status this is at. So I can see the journal entry here. And what it's telling me is that actually in the destination company, the journal hasn't been posted. So this is quite useful for actually reconciling these intercompany transactions. So that's it. Hopefully this brief introduction has given you an idea of how Nolan's intercompany postings can really help your business. To get the software or if you have any other questions about this product, please contact your account manager or email us at the address on this slide. Thank you.